probably the one thing that gets the most use by every member of the family in every single home. We're talking about what some may refer to as the loo or the throne. Mm -hmm. right? You know, there are toilets and then there are toilets. And now they're going high tech. Our partner, our home improvement insider, Adam Helfman of HireDone.com has amazing stories of advances right in the toilet. If you're one of those homeowners that spends a lot of time in deep thought in the bathroom, then you're going to want to know about the latest and greatest in toilet technology. Let's go take a look. Bathroom remodeling is slated to overtake kitchen remodeling as the number one request in home improvement in 2017. Today, we're going to learn about four toilet technologies that are going to help make your bathroom experience even more delightful. We're at the Infusion Kitchen and Bath showrooms, and they have one of the largest working displays of Kohler fixtures in Michigan. Let's take a look at some of the technology in the back of the bowl. So this Kohler toilet has aqua piston technology, so when you flush it, water goes around 360 degrees into the bowl, which virtually eliminates all plugs. So for those of us that are germaphobes, this next toilet is the one for you. So this toilet, all you got to do is when you're done, you just take your hand and wipe it over the side here, and it flushes without touching a thing. Not only is the technology in the toilet, but it's also in the seat. This is the Pure Fresh toilet seat. It removes odors and fills the space with a clean scent. Last up, we've got the big daddy of all toilets. It's called the Kohler Numi, and this toilet does everything. You can use the remote control to open the seat. You can always flush it with the button. And if you want, you can even listen to the radio. And if that's not enough, you've got a heated seat and heated feet. As you can see here, there's a lot of technology packed into these toilets. And here's one other fact. The average homeowner uses 100 gallons of water per day. These toilets are designed to save water. And if you're saving water, you're saving money. Are you kidding? A heated seat, heated floor, music coming out of the toilet. How are you, Adam Helfman? Good, Good to, see, to you. see you, pal. Always. So tell us about these new trends, because this has been around for a minute, but we're starting to see more and more things that are connected. Well, again, the migration between the smarter house, yeah. technology, you know, in 1997, toilets changed. The government said you got to use less water, and everyone rushed to make new toilets, but there was a problem. You had to flush twice, you had to do a lot of things. So you weren't saving anything. Yeah. Exactly. So today, they've evolved. Let's take a look at this quick toilet okay. here. So this is a square, nice Kohler toilet. It's mm -hmm. very popular, mm -hmm. very stately. But this one has two buttons. One for number one. <laughs> yeah, because you don't need a lot of water. Right, and one yeah. for the other. Yeah. So it's very efficient, self-cleaning, and in, in the bowl itself, it has special coatings, so it's easy, it's like self-cleaning, so you okay. don't have a problem. All right. So obviously we uh, want to talk about tubs because it's very popular. Uh, bathroom remodeling has now overtaken kitchen remodeling as the number one remodeling project. So this tub is made out of acrylic, and it's by a company called MTI. Oh, it looks and, like a china yeah, tub, but of right? course that'd be a lot heavier. Right. Yeah. It's mold resistant, mildew resistant, easy, easy to clean, Wow. pretty much maintenance free. Yeah. So it's, you know, a part of your bathroom remodeling project. It's very popular if you're the tub type of person. Okay. Back here, we just brought a sample uh, assembly of a couple of fixtures and faucets that people can get. Um, pull out sprayer. Right. Automatically goes back. This is Swarovski crystals. Mm-hmm. For the fancy person in you. Yeah, it is. Uh, and by the way, it's not that expensive. So, you know, a lot of people say, oh, these must be in the thousands. It's under $1,000. And, and you have to remember, when you're redoing a bathroom, if you're blowing up, this is a one-time deal, really, in right. your lifetime. So if you process. like it, uh, you know. Exactly. Right. We have uh, uh, shiny chrome and brushed nickel. Yeah. So these are what the, the trends are. A little bit higher spout, so people can get their hands underneath. Mm -hmm. And it's done well. And then we brought another toilet, of course, uh, that just shows a stately, elegant, very popular, matches most decors. But that's also a high-tech toilet in the Correct. sense that it doesn't use All a lot of new, water, yeah. right? If you're going to buy a new toilet today, you really need to buy one that is low-flow, 
and high efficiency. Okay. And then our friends at Infusion, they have all that. They're the largest Kohler distributor and in, in showroom in Metro Detroit. So Good to know. So really uh, specials, because you're our special hookup guy. Well, so today we got a really good one. <laughs> okay. Okay. So uh, we have 40% off one item. Wow. And then 25% off the rest of your order. So if you're remodeling a bathroom, yeah. okay, if you're thinking of remodeling and you just want to upgrade a toilet, you've got to go get the coupon. Okay, mm -hmm. and it's on the Click on Detroit website. It's okay. on the Hired Done website. In fact, we have a live stream afterwards okay. to talk about it. But like this tub is four thousand dollars. Yeah. Forty percent off today. Yeah. So oh, yeah. It makes sense. It's Good a, it's stuff. A heck of a deal. And you know, when you talk about bathrooms taking over kitchen remodeling as a as a number one thing to do, that's not just because I'm going to enjoy it. There's a payback to if you ever do resell. Oh, of it. course. According to a Harvard study, uh, eighty-five percent of all remodeling and kitchens and baths yeah. give you your money right back right when you start. Good stuff. Good to see you as always. Adam's going to be hosting Facebook Live right after the show, as you heard him talk about. Uh, that's on the uh, Local 4 uh, Facebook page, so you can see what's on tap today, and uh, he'll be talking about all kinds of stuff. So we encourage our viewers to join the conversation with Adam after the show. Go to Facebook.com slash Local 4. Good to see you. Over to you, Tom.